Oh, hello, the internet. Didn't see you there. This is Eric from PPC Hero. Today, we're going to do a quick tutorial on how you can determine which keywords have triggered which queries in your search term report. So to start, you're going to need to go to the Keywords tab in the AdWords interface. Once you're there, hit the Keyword Details button and select All, search terms All, for the time range that you've selected. Now once you're in your search term report, make sure you've added the new keyword column just recently added into the AdWords interface. This is going to allow you to quickly identify which queries are affiliated with each keyword along with the campaign and ad group information. So that's really the simplest version of how you can match up your queries and your keywords. But we're not quite finished yet. The real magic happens when you apply some Excel wizardry to the new keyword column. So what you're going to want to do is download your search query report and open it up in Excel. You're going to want to clean it up by deleting the report title in row 1 and the totals at the bottom of the spreadsheet. You've probably guessed by now that by doing this, we're prepping the sheet for one of Sean Quadlin's favorite tools, the Almighty Pivot Table. So once you've prepped the document, select all of it, and then whether it be through Windows or Mac, create a pivot table using the data that you've now highlighted. Now in your new pivot table, you're going to want to add keyword and then search term as your row values. Now doing this will then lay out each query that makes up the statistics that comprise basically the overall stats for your keyword over the time range that you've selected. So in this case, uh, for the business continuity phrase match keyword or the other keywords listed here, you can see the different search terms that made up those statistics for this time range. And then after this you can play with it by adding in clicks or impressions, uh, cost and conversion, and then if you want to get really fancy you can add in some calculated fields to determine click-through rate, conversion rate, and cost per conversion and see on a more detailed level uh, just how the statistics break down for the queries in these keywords. And that's it, really. The insights are yours to find in this report now, but that's the quick and painless method you can use to determine how your queries and your keywords match up, all of which is now made possible through the new keywords column added into the search term report. So if you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave them in our comments section below. And as always, thanks for watching.